ISIS leader killed in a drone strike in Syria. The deadly attack was carried out on Friday. U.S. officials say those same drones were harassed for about two hours by Russian aircraft on the same day, the third such incident that week. Here's ABC's Mary Alice Parks. Tonight, the Department of Defense says a drone strike on Friday near Aleppo, Syria, has killed known ISIS leader Usama al muhajid who a Defense Department official said was riding a motorcycle at the time. The head of the U.S. Central Command writing, this will disrupt and degrade ISIS's ability to plan and conduct terror attacks. The Pentagon says the strike was conducted by MQ-9 Reaper drones, the very same drones that earlier in the day were harassed by Russian planes, a new and growing problem in the region. For three straight days this week, Russian planes flying dangerously close to U.S. unmanned aircraft over Syria. The Pentagon releasing these rare videos showing Russian planes deploying parachute flares in the flight path of an American drone, forcing the drone over Syria to engage in evasive maneuvers. The next day, a Russian pilot seen here flying just above a U.S. drone and scattering the sky with more flares. The U.S. typically uses a deconfliction hotline to let the Russians know when they'll be operating in this area of northwest Syria, which is part of what makes this behavior towards the drones so concerning, since in theory, the Russians were given a heads up that they would be there. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.